Hi everyone and welcome to another question of the day. These are the questions I answer from the Geekanoids forums. If you want to leave me a new question, check out the link in the video description. Today's question comes from JohnT1512. Hi John. The question is Siri for OS X. And John goes on to say, do you think Apple should incorporate Siri or something very similar into OS X? Would love to hear your thoughts on this. Personally, I think it would be very useful to be able to use both voice search in Safari and voice commands for opening and using apps on your Mac and would really help computer users who have disabilities that affect their upper limbs. I totally agree. I really like your viewpoint on this. Now, of course, we've got Siri already on our mobile devices, on the iPad, on the iPhone, for example. And I think Apple would be very wise to integrate this into OS X. We've already got features that make it easier for users with disabilities to use the desktop operating system, but nothing quite like Siri. We can, of course, dictate to our desktop computers already, so we can perhaps load up pages or Word and dictate text into it. But it would be great if Apple took this one step further and allowed us to do voice searches, allowed us to control apps, launching them, maybe even telling the cursor where to go on the screen. I think that would be a great feature for people with disabilities. And if anyone can do this right and elegantly, it's Apple. And I think they should really explore this area. Maybe they're already working on it because I think it would really open up the whole world of possibilities to people that would otherwise struggle to use desktop operating systems. So great question, John. I totally agree with you. And if anyone else has got any comments about this subject, please do leave them in the comment section below. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you very much for watching. If you wanna see another video of mine, please do click the annotation on the top of your screen now. And also, you can click the annotation on the bottom of your screen and subscribe to the Geekanoids channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all again next time.